Hello and welcome to this short tutorial video from Production Assist. In this video, we show how you can change basic settings in Production Assist. Under the drop-down menu File – Settings, you will find options for altering the basic settings. A distinction is made here between the app, the current project and virtual printing. As for printing, the available settings are pretty clear because these primarily concern the border settings that come into play when I want to format a PDF. Project settings allow you to enter your production facts and figures. These always form the header, for example, the headline of your online documents. These include setting the dates for the event, as well as information on the location of the event. App settings allow you to choose all the basic settings that affect your drawing. These include the system of units and the representational properties. For example, the global transformation function concerns a change to the relative parent, if one exists. Here is an example with these two truss lines that are to be placed in an assembly group T1. Thus, T2 is designated as a child of T1 but does not yet refer to this parent. If I check the heights of the trusses here, that is, if I look at the C-axis, I see that the value is 0 cm for the shorter truss and 500 cm for the longer one. So, both have a global relationship to the floor area. Now I raise the shorter truss a bit higher, to 1 meter, and again, Look at the settings in this area. As soon as I display the reference here in the global relation to the floor area, its dependence on the parent now becomes clear. Because the parent, T1, is now displayed with an altitude of 0 and the child, T2, has a height of minus 400 and is thus measured relative to the parent. Further settings can be made on the web app under User Settings. Here you can differentiate between profile settings, account and billing, security, review, templates and settings. The profile setting allows a profile photo. Account and billing shows me the subscription setting and my teammates. Under security, I can change my password. And the review templates show more ways to organize reviews of my plans. Here is an example. I add a review and call it Review 2. And can use the Edit icon to add the reviewer who is to inspect. For example, Video, Light and Rigging. Settings concern recurring settings which we have already discussed above with respect to File Settings. To sum up, basic settings can be specified on the app via the menu File Settings and on the web app under User Settings. The app provides settings for the system units and for the display. Global transformation and review templates are important and helpful. We will be happy to answer even more questions in the next video. Thank you for your attention.